teams vying for a spot in the upper bracket. Again, if they trade games, they can maybe make it together. If they 2-0, they can knock the other crew out. I don't know what that is. Oh, is that what it is? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> oh, deny. They're on Abed in the middle oh, lane. Easy courier for Schofield, thanks to that ward. You that ward doing that one. Doing work down here. Uh, but a good kill. They take down the Phoenix. But I just I don't think it like snowballs that well. And I, okay. I think that under their assumption. Oh, why? Trouble. Rock down low has another whirling death, and that should do it. Sacred comes on in, cleans up. But Schofield is just harassing away uh, oh, our TZ got here. It. Let's go. And we'll get controlled, but Sacred from the high ground wanting to bring him down here. Don't know if he's going to have enough damage. Free kill on the Schofield. Yeah, Saberlight snags it with the Wrath of Nature. There's Stinger is getting low up top. Look at the TP in for the last plank of damage. Trying to also go on to Hector. Abed's right on him. They blow him up. Can they take down Stinger? Yes. So big rotations coming out from Shopify Rebellion. Stinger's just trying to hold on to this tower for all that he's worth. He has gotten a lot of levels, though, as there has been some movement away from this side of the map. The slow pops the stick, turns, dives, gets some separation. Sacred makes the move. Abed, low mana right now. Wanted to jump onto him, oh, caught for the moment, but they got him. Abed is going to die. Well played on that rotation and all set up by Stinger. Schofield tries to run down crit. Catches him there with the chakram through. Has Avalanche in two. Does pop it now. Trying to get away. But with the slowdown there, they're going to leave the kill over to Sacred. Hector. Dire Obs saw Storm moving through. I believe it also just saw Arteezy. So they know there's so many heroes down bottom. And that lets Derek Mago have a little bit of fun mid. Also can see right here. Creeps blocking out the Ancients in towards mid. They're going to go for the all-in. Blade Mail out. Boat out. Does he just walk away? Sacred throws out the Chakram. The Control Stinger tries to turn this one. Doesn't have any points in the Sunray. They just go for boss that early. Yep. So their, uh, their Shard killing isn't that great. Um, it'll mostly just be oh. Sacred. Can they bring him down? The heal. It's pretty good. The boat gets off in the end. But Dark Mago, he's going to die. Sacred, trying to control, find Abed, they blow him up actually. Oh, that was well done. Taking that away. A big kill onto Hector. And find Saberlight. Nothing to stop this one. The boat, it goes out, the connection there. They have a sleeping dart if they need it. And gonna Abed? use it now onto Abed. Oh, they wanna chase for more. They will find Schofield, get him killed. Can they get any more? Dark Mago, he's just walking away. Zip in, find Stinger, throw out the X, backs out. Sacred onto him, out of mana. Abed oh, in no. trouble. The toss back though, oh, the save was there. It was very good. That keeps him alive. And Abed going to escape, but can they keep the tower alive? Was that a Lucy theme save? That was crazy. I thought he was dead for sure. I believe we have one on Kunkka as well that uh, is still fresh at nine seconds. So it's, it's KBs everywhere. Who gets the job? Make the move in. They find him. Dead on Sacred. Boat out. Dark Mago pops the BKB. Turns for the fight. They throw back in Stinger. He needs to get the dive away. Does have Egg Force Staff. Oh, nice. Up to the high ground to keep him alive. Abed, does he want to chase in for this? Or are they just going to oh. give up their tower? Stinger hiding, dodging, but the damage is <laughs> enough. Move down bottom for Saberlight. TP's in. And he has no blade. BKB. Dark Mago's ready for him. Ready with the torrent. Pulls him back in, and an easy kill there. And look at the rest of Shopify, too, smoking up, running their way down bottom. Are they just going to run right into Schofield? This Ricky, persistently annoying. Where's the detection? They spot him immediately, but now that guy's time for the rest LSA. of the team. Although, let's say turn. Do they have enough to kill him off? Or it's easy. He's got his BKB still. He looks like he's going to be fine. The X, they find the pullback onto Abed, but can't find the follow-up stun. Now the chase coming from Sacred. Stinger wants to run at him. They get the pull. He can't get the supernova off. Fly. Back and forth they go. Another X. Arteezy held his BKB that entire time. The blade mail is good, but will it be good enough? Boat for the damage mitigation has to back out. And there's no way for that to work. There we go. Checking it out. Beautiful. Oh, no. In trouble. Got fully controlled. Great play coming out from Crit. 
He made that one perfectly. Now the Avalanche, sleeping dart onto one. Abed can't chase. Beast Coast trying to run away. They have a Gleipnir fully completed now. I, I guess he just thought he'd be fast enough on the BKB. I mean, to be fair, so did I. Like, yeah. how many times have you seen a tiny blink oh, in? They catch him. No BKB, Abed's gone. Just like that, and now Shopify, they have to get the hell out of here. The chase is gonna be big. Sacred tries to back away. Beautiful Supernova egg. up on the high ground. The LSA connects, but it's gonna be a BKB. Or TZ just turned and hit it. And now look at these claims. He bounces back and forth. You get close enough. You start taking him down, but they get the sleeping dart after oh, the crit. BKB wears out. But crit, he comes in to clean it up, and Schofield in trouble needs to get out of there. How did it work so well? How did it go so well for Shopify? No Kunkka. Vision still remaining here, Shopify, and they know that. I said Scovio. Oh, Scovio. Ooh, You're dead. jump, Avatos. Crit and Arteezy, the dynamic duo. They take him down. So much vision. Yeah, they'll finally get a D ward here. It's getting low. Is there any way you go into this? I don't they think can. so. Wow. 24 to 13. This game has been an absolute banger. If they bring back with the shard on Kunkka, Spin. they're kind of ditching. It's easy. Yeah, uh, he's, he's making sure that they're safe. And the toss back gets him. BKB tries to run, wants to get out, but he's dead. He's gone so quickly. The little crit Hector. to end it, and they find him. Hector in trouble. The TP in. This BKB timing was so strong. Arteezy, he's not stopping. Going in for more. Why not? They find Sacred, tries the Timber Chain to get some separation. The Sun Ray, the heal, a Timber Chain. What the hell was that? One more hit, does he get the crit? The trees are there. The trees, they're not healthy for you. A triple kill for Artur. Yeah, that is that is the danger zone. He's dancing up. And they find him. Dude, how many times has Dark Mago been tossed back? How many? I want a number. Oh, uh, wait. They hold, find another. Hold. Saber Light's there. They get him. The Torrent, the boat. But the jump forward from Abed finds Stinger, kills him off. They do not have the Lena with them. And the Timber Saw, he can't do enough right now. Sacred tries to get away, but the Avalanche is there to interrupt his Timber Chain. Get out. And now this 5k gold lead is a 9k gold lead. Easy run up and force that yeah. out. What a bud. Yeah. Make sure protecting it for it. All right. Grit's been doing everything this game. Schofield needs the big setup. You said he looked like he was in his anime pose. Crit has mm. been doing anime things in this one. Tries to pull him back. They have it. The torrent, the control is there, but the BKB is out and immediately turns onto the egg. Can they bring it down? The answer is yes. Crit is dead. Can they find any way to shut down this devastating launch at them? And Saberlight, he pops the newly minted BKB. Tideaway pulls him in. The boat's down. The overgrowth onto everybody. Lena can't do anything but throw out an LSA. Okay, the buyback from the Phoenix. They're on Saberlight. The torrent, it comes nice. out in time. So an overextension, they get the melee racks. True. Being level 17. It's feeling great. And he just got 18 as well. So now he has 20 bonus armor. You guys want to try and deal with that, but oh, look at this positioning. The full wrap around here, Schofield. Toss him back, but the X, good play, good play. Right, that was sick. Gleipnir afterwards tries to get out of there, keeping him alive, but Schofield already dead. Does not have buyback. Need to make something happen here. The Tithe Bringer pulls him back forward. The disarm, though, long duration on Alina. Hasn't been able to attack almost at all. Saberlight's TPing out with already two oh, dead, and the buyback, the control is there. Fly has the overgrowth, connects onto all, but the BKB pop and then the turn away. They've already killed Arteezy. No, this is working slaying. out perfect. He's slaying. Hector has come online. The DD Lena, the triple kill for Sacred, and now the Aegis. Oh man, they lost Schofield early. Stinger forced to egg because creeps were about to kill him. With no, neither of the supports really able to help out other than tanking the slightest bit of damage at the start, they Lina turn around coming. that entire fight. That's also crazy. Everyone smoked smoke. up. Smoke on smoke. Crit sees them all. Avalanche can't find the toss target. BKB out. But the big catch from Abed tries to blow them all up at the start. Sacred turns. The dive forward. The egg up Sager. on the high ground. This turn, it is not good for Shopify. Arteezy they slept. need to disengage. Arteezy, he's in no man's land, but might just be able to glaive everybody to death. Lean is dead. No buyback. Arteezy, he did it. Oh my god. Sacred trying to get out of there, but three dead. So they're just gonna try and play I mean, this one safe if doesn't they can matter go all with in. Luna. Like, yeah, 
After the glyph, you, you just chunk. So much damage. The sleeping dart is going to try and delay this. But it is really hard to imagine that they don't at the very least get Megas. And if they keep going, this game just might be over. 35 seconds. They use the glyph on this. So they're trying to get them to make a play. But the toss back, he was there. He finds him sacred. Double Chakram out, trying to separate. Does have a Timber Chain again, but he's gone. That's one death. Does have buyback, gonna have to use it here. This is Megas at the very least. Do Shopify try and go for more? I mean, if they knew that Beast Coast didn't have buyback, that was the end of the game. One, taking the creeps in. Oh, they're, they're in. Have That's easy. AC That's easy. done. Looking, the pull. He's on the top of all of them. They immediately pop all their ultis. The Supernova is ready, as well as that Sunray. They're keeping them back for the moment. Saberlight down super low. Wait a minute, have they gone in a bit too far? Trying to kill them off, a couple hits, it's good. Abed goes in for another round. The catch is there though. Lena needs to pop Satanic, trying to live. K1 Hector is dead. Gone for 100 seconds, and with that, it is gonna be Shopify Rebellion taking game number one trying to secure their spot in the upper bracket. What a clutch performance. All right, the next time you see a Luna from Shopify yeah. or a Storm Spirit, don't groan. True. Think back to this. Pretty good. I have to agree. That looks very solid. I love the other four heroes on their team for just making space. It'd be a pretty quiet laning stage overall as Crit has a bit of a uh, surprise maneuver mid here. Forum and... Get some good damage, Dark Mago. Does have that fairy fire ready, dude, tries to dude, walk away. Dude, dude. That is another stun. That is a first blood. First All right. Blood. Dire, pretty item dependent, right? You need the blink dagger on time. Feel useful. So what is it? And Saberlight, ooh, that's nice. Tries to teep, but Gust, a good answer for that one. It's mid, Dark Mago, Avalanche, toss back, Abed finds him underneath the tower, but Creeps keeping him alive, and now the turn. Dodges up to the north, but will die to the tower there. Wand coming out now, and then he's off into uh, the blade mail once more. I mean, hey, if there's a less rack in the game, it's a tiny. It'll be good. Maybe catch a profit ulti as well. Toss back, Avalanche, Stinger, Saberlight playing up close. And they catch Crit, Mago. though. Body blocks there, doing what damage they can, and they don't have another level, but we'll throw out that torrent, Ooh. and that one connects onto Saberlight. So the boat coming out, it will be enough to secure the kill. Arm up the neutrals a little Sacred. bit here. It's not doing too hot. Catches one. I in some trouble, and now looking for Abed, he gets the roll back nice the angle. other way. Yeah, and that's going to be enough to secure it. Soloed. 1,500-ish gold behind now point but it has the blade mail so right. might be looking for some ancient stacks here pretty soon no builds go field we'll just catch him in the cogs torrent's gonna follow but top fight stinger he's made sure that he didn't get any runes and crit hector's, actually might be in trouble yeah hector's positioning has been great toss back crit he's gonna pay for this oh one. dude no how many times this Major, have I seen this happen? Yeah, I've kind of been waiting for the uh, the counterplay down bottom here as well for Shopify, where they want to move into this tower. It looks like it is coming now, as I'm saying this. Schofield still has the hook shot as the trees are dead. Hector, they see everybody it's, it's now. It's him again! Toss, they toss him in! And the haunt afterwards. Gust, try and get away. Crit looking. They will run down Schofield, although he gets the hook shot the other way. And it's Stinger that kills Arteezy. Schofield running out of there. They toss Saberlight on top of him. Making space. He is going to die eventually, but while that haunt was going on, they caught Spectre up top. Yeah, I guess he didn't uh, manage to finish the play, huh? Hector, it's going to be tough for him to play around this, and they're doing a really good job of blocking out these camps. As well, hook shot in, though. They find him. Saberlight, he goes down dead. Crit, he's going to get caught by that boat. Schofield staying alive with that damage he's, mitigation. He's Eventually, trades. he's going to fall. But yeah, that is uh, in the tree armor. Look how long he lives. Fly under vision here. He's trying to find some good wards, but he is quite dead. Shot in. Hogs caught, and... Save for a moment, but this is going to be a dead fly trying to get some vision down on the map. Speed burst, yes. 
I, I think this is maybe a sign of things to come, though. They're going to try and take this fight without Han. Is it going to work, though? Sacred rolls in, is in trouble. Greaves, he can't get him off. Couldn't cast it. Schofield now caught. He's going to die. K1 says, get me out of here. Look at this turn from Shopify Rebellion as they swarm him down four dead. Everything online. They're ready. Ultimate powerful combination of spells. Really in the favor of, uh, of Rebel Rebels if they have any of their cooldowns. Easy. He jumps in. He is actually pulled in by the Kunkka. But now Hector trying to run away. They have the X for the pullback. Tries to get him with the Pango roll. Oh, oh my god. The tip to get body combo. It's happening. Oh no. They need to be careful. They got to run. Or are they ready to go for more? Overgrowth comes out from Stinger. Tries to step away. But it is Abed that shows up and cleans up that drought. Takes away so much of their damage. Dark Mago is going to die. Sacred trying to kill off that hero and well it is going to be specter dead they hook shot in try to push back abed the big bad lesh is way too strong a four staff away but oh. shopify rebellion they have so much control oh, they have the tree it. armor the heal they throw everything <laughs> schofield's actually managing to escape it looks like has another battery assault connects there for the moment still living cogs push back trying to deny it but well, is he going to die? He gets under tower rage. That gives him even more armor. Just the oh, Tumblr's toy away. Oh, almost. How? If he dodged the avalanche with that Tumblr's toy, that would have been so good. <laughs> Shopify are just looking really good in the series. They're, they're looking incredibly strong. Now, the Rocket Flare is going to go out. I think it takes Scofield. them too long to get there. Empty the inventory slot. We're going in. Oh, yeah. He's smoking. He's oh, for yeah. It. Schofield. Can he get it, though? Flare, TP, Flare, and he's TP. This guy's a legend. Oh my God, he's dude, a if this legend. Works, if it works, they're haunting. Dude, he's gonna make he's it. Looking, he's trying. Schofield jumps into the pit. He's a second too late now. And then the fourth staff out of there. Wait, the roll? They're going for this fight? Okay, they've got Dark Mago control. Stinger is already dead. The Drow trying to do what damage she can. Actually catching uh, onto Abbott there. Four staff away from Saberlight. The gust is out, but Spectre on her case. They already burned through the Aegis. Sacred, Dark Mago, they need to come help him, but no, they, they, they get it. away. Trying to take this lead that they have and turn it into sort of a substantial one. Already 70% win probability. They're going to look to take down one of these tier two towers. Take a good fight at some point, although Abed, can they bait out any BKBs from him right now? It's pretty hard to imagine that he's in any real danger. And in fact, they just turn and kill Mago if he's not careful. Although, hook shot in. The Cogs crane some separation. Boat is out. This has turned into a oh, bit of Hector. a fight. And Ava toss BKB out, trying to do what damage they can. Saberlight, he's on him too. They're bouncing back and forth though, and they find Arteezy, he's dead. Hector is gonna fall too. The overgrowth is there. Control now onto Saberlight. They have no damage. From the overgrowth, and yeah, with, with no damage, they just have to run. Somehow finding some success oh. in that chaos. Abed, thinking about popping his ult, he's worried about getting a hook shot here. Your all right, spotted. Jump in. Ulti immediately. They all in Hector. Cannot get away from that wall, but he's walking away. Creating some separation. He actually does get out. I can't believe that that happened. That and might be something that's going to be there to save uh, Hector. Us finds Hector. Four staff tries to get away. Gust, run, tree, throne, sacred, pops everything. Ogre oh. seal. Ogre seal gets him away. Sacred. Does he pop his ulti? He doesn't have it back off cooldown. And Hector just trying to run. Crit throwing out. Not that it matters. Yeah. Uh, there's no chance. This one's going to Shopify. Abed takes the Aegis for himself. And ready for the fight. They're here again. Okay, hook shot forward, overgrowth connection. Sacred tries to get his ulti off. Does manage to make it happen. The Shadow Demon's already dead. Can they find any more afterwards? Saber Light under control here. And I mean, Drow, he's been able to live through all that. If he can re-enter the fight, this could actually look okay for them. Stinger's being controlled and taken down by Saber Light. Schofield gets the Cogs pushback. Oh, nice. And Drow from the low ground, they make the kill happen on a crit. And now chasing down Abed. Drow's on top of him. Abed's gone once. 
Can they do this a again? Shadow step in a few seconds here. Saberlight's coming in behind for a turn. Looking for him. Saberlight trying to get him, but the Manta the turn. The PKB the four step gets away. The Tide Bringer, Tidal Wave rather, and then the walk away. The Blade Mail trying to get on top of oh, Abed. No. Abed is too strong. Triple kill for the Lesh and the tip from Crit. Appreciating what he's seen, although he did walk into two cogs. Cleaning it up, and in case you need a little bit more secure, now the site is delivered there to Abed. God, he, like, they just have to work so hard to try and win these fights from Beast Coast. Yeah. That's that's the difference. A perfect draft. Executed very well. Abed will get away from those cogs. They try and pull one back in. They will catch on to Saber Light, and, well, boat gonna go out. It will land. Some good damage. Find the finish there onto the NP, but the first tier three tower to fall. All right, but maybe Stinger's uh, Paladin Sword Tree and Protect with the big saving grace. Will, there's a way. The big heals. Never expect the 14% heals. They still have Ogre Seal on Drow just for the repositioning. She needs the, the Ogre. The Hex. They get the Force. There's the second one used. Dark Mago living through it. They don't have an Aegis this time around, but I don't know if that's going to matter. Dark Mago just TPs out of there. I think there's one left behind, one tossed back. They find the clockwork, catch him now in the cog. Stroud doesn't do what damage she can, but it's not going to be oh, enough. No. And the Hex is there. The stun for the follow-up, the control, the triple kill. Saber Light takes him down, and with no buyback, there is no third set for them to go to, because Tier 2 is still standing. They have hot back in two seconds. Yeah, they're, they're going to find Sacred. They're going to fight Dark Mago. The BKBs are out. Immediately TPing away. Sacred. He is likely going to be doing the same thing here in just a second. Does break an Aeon Disc, but Schofield also trying to run. They find him. K1 tries to get away. Not going to happen. Dead for 70. No buyback. And that is going to be the signal for Shopify to run it down the lane. Should be the Tier 3 tower for pretty much free. If they wanted to keep going for more. Yeah, blink in, find the kill on the Stinger. Okay, a little bit of, uh, you know, stuff going on between teammates there. But 30,000 gold lead and crit animation canceling as they are trying to close this one out. They will secure upper bracket with 20 seconds left. Dark Mago does have the X for the pullback, trying to delay this game. You get a tidal wave. The roll immediately caught in the sprout. Yep. Manages to get out of it, actually, though. The boat's going to land. And Arteezy is getting a little bit lower. Sacred tries to get him. Oh, no, the <laughs> leash. They got him. Avalanche looks for the toss back. Gets him there. On to Abed. Tries to get away. Schofield, he hooks shots forward. And does do some damage now from K1 Hector. Trying to kill off Arteezy. Seeing if they can bring him down, and they will. Okay, the sh Shatter doing some good damage there too. Tossing him away, still trying to survive, but it was a buyback. It was the game. GG is called. Upper bracket secured. Shot by very clean coming to this one. Man, the, uh, the drafting stuff of them, very interesting.